Hey guys, Big Films 39 here with my unboxing of the double feature of Batman Sub Zero, Batman and Mr. Freeze Sub Zero, and Batman Mask of the Phantasm. Uh, I've recently picked up and unboxed every season of Batman the Animated Series and Batman Beyond, also Justice League and X Men the Animated Series. So check out all of those unboxings. And also something I'm doing, uh, just mentioning on my videos now. Shopkick, which is a really cool app, uh, totally free. You get points uh, for walking into stores. You redeem these points for gift cards. It's literally that simple and easy. I'll leave my link in the description. If you join through my link, you help me out, help me get points. So I can get another cool movie to unbox uh, with you guys. So check that out. It's really awesome. Link in the description. But um, back to business. Batman Sub-Zero and Mask of the Phantasm. I think Phantasm came out in 93, and I believe that was the first season of the animated series. I actually don't think I've ever seen uh, Mask of the Phantasm, and I know it's uh, it has like a cult following. It's really popular uh, among Batman fans, and I just don't think I ever uh, saw it as a kid. Sub-Zero I did see. I think this came out five years later in 98. Um... I can't remember if I watched this when it was actually released, but I did watch it when I was really young, and I think I watched it a few times on TV after that, and I really love this movie from what I remember. Uh, I love the episode of Mr. Freeze in Volume 1 of Batman the Animated Series. I thought it was phenomenal. Um just with that old style of animation and uh you know they gave mr freeze that really kind of weird robotic voice and you know he looked real creepy i thought like an alien and i loved his story i loved that episode always loved sub-zero i don't remember everything about it but i remember it having you know good action and everything i know um, the ending was really great when robin and batman have to escape that facility and everything's blowing up uh, so I can't wait to give both of these movies a watch. And I bought it brand new, uh, real cheap on Amazon. It was like eight bucks and fifty cents, I think. So glad I was able to get that cheap. Twice the fight, two feature length, Dark Knight Adventures. Uh, I feel like reading that, but I don't think I will. Batman and Mr. Freeze Sub-Zero includes full screen version. The Hunt for Mr. Freeze game. Get the picture. How to draw Batman. Music montage. Cast and crew information. Trailers. Batman Mask of the Phantasm includes full screen version and the theatrical trailer. Region 1 DVD not rated. Mask of the Phantasm rated PG. Runtime 76 minutes. And Sub Zero runtime 67 minutes, and it's not rated. And Sub Zero, I believe, only had a TV release, and uh, Phantasm, Mask of the Phantasm, actually had a theatrical re release, which I find very, um, I find that very weird, just because you know Batman was a TV show, kind of a campy thing. And anyway, I I wouldn't have been able to see the movie because I was actually born that year, so... Kind of weird that there was a Batman animated movie just around the time I was born, if not before that. So, real excited to check that one out. And inside, no disc art. Looks like they're doing the flipper disc thing, which... Actually, I don't know if it's a... Well, actually, it probably is. Let's see what it says. Um, I think it's both. They're both on uh, one side. I'm not positive, but that's probably a flipper disc. Oh well, no disc art. I don't like the flipper disc, but I guess that's the way it is. All right, guys, that's my unboxing of the double feature of Batman and Mr. Freeze Sub-Zero and Batman Mask of the Phantasm on DVD. Thank you for watching. Please like the video, comment, and subscribe.
don't forget to join Shopkick through my link in the description. And check out all of my other unboxings and recent movie reviews. Take care, guys. I'll see you later. Bye.